Um, everybody's out here competing. Um, that's the one thing you've seen. Uh, the dudes start to really get a grasp on uh, just trying to make the person in front of you better. Um, I feel like more dudes starting to take more pride in that on both sides of the ball, you know, just trying to give the other dude, you know, the best look that they can. Because, um, you know, I, I tell, tell the guys all the time, we in this together. We lose together, we win together. So, um, yeah, that's everybody just been trying to push each other to that, to that limit. First day, Coach Ravel said passing it wasn't necessarily Chris, but it's like the way he's progressing. Have you seen specifically throwing wide receiver quarterback chemistry? Um, shoot, it was just really, you know, just getting our timing back. And, uh, you know, the first couple of days, you know, dudes get fatigued, dudes, uh, you know, still trying to get still trying to get all the concepts and stuff you know um but we've been we've been doing a way better job you know these past uh like two days two practices uh really you know grasping the concept getting the timing down um so i feel like we're making progress in that mm -hmm. oh yeah no every day every day um shoot he was my roommate he was my roommate last season um Every day, you know, I tell we we just have a thing. You know, I'm gonna make you better. You gonna make me better. Uh, so I always tell him, I say, should you stop me? You stop anybody. You know, I go against you. I beat anybody. I'm like, you the best. I'm the best. You know, we gotta we gotta approach every practice like that. And um, going back, you know, to what I said earlier, you know, we just want to make each other better. We win together. We lose together. So. But in the moment, it's competitive, right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's competitive. Yeah, it it, it gets competitive, but you know. We on the same team, you know. We compete. We compete with each other. Um, I don't even consider co competing against them. You know, we're competing with each other. We want to make each other better. Um, so yeah, I mean, sometimes you know you don't win. It gets frustrating, but you know, it's just long practice. You, know, you got to see him the rest of the practice. You got to see me tomorrow. The day after that. The day after that. So um, you know, it's just about improvement. You know, want my want my guys to get better. Want, I want to get better. Um, you know, so just that competition is is great for both of us. I know you haven't seen it, I guess, a scrimmage or game setting yet, but the attention someone like Keon draws, the experience he has, I mean, how, how does that make your job easier just on a play-by-play -play basis? Um, shoot, Keon coming in, you know, uh, he was, you know, he was excited to learn the offense, you know, just hurry up and dive in and really, you know, get the grasp of everything. So that, you know, that helps other guys like me in the offense, you know what I mean? Like someone that wants to come in and, and really know the whole offense and want to be, Productive, want to be a factor, you know, for the for the whiteouts. Uh, it, it's fun having that, like that that bond. You know what I mean? Like, okay, I got this dude with me. You know, I, I could count on him to make plays. You know, he count on me to make plays, and it makes it more fun to play out there. You know, know you got another dude on the other side. You know, that's that's gonna fight. You know, it's gonna battle, just like you are. So, um, you know, having having that dude out there, you know, too, it's been it's gonna be scary. It's gonna be scary. That's that's all I'm gonna say. It's gonna be scary. Makes it obviously intense. Yeah. Intense the way he go up there and grab the ball, Chris Browns. But I, I say his energy. You know what I mean? Like he gonna go full speed every play, every rep, every practice. Uh, you know what I mean? Like he, he's just very intense, locked in dude. So uh, you know that that helped me for a dude like me. You know what I mean? It's like seeing him just full speed every play, every release, every no matter what it is. It's like okay, I, that started to help me out with my with my game, and I started applying that to me too. So um, you know, having a dude like him, you know, he, he he's good at what he does too. So um, we both just learn from each other. Mm -hmm. What have you seen from those two guys? What, what can they add to this offense? Sure. I guess start with Destin. Yeah, no, Destin came in. Um, another guy that's been, you know, he's been very open to, you know, learning learn the offense. You know, that's the main thing in, in our offense. you got to learn offense in order to get out there and play and make plays. So um, with him, you know, like he's been committed to learning offense, learning, learning every play, learning every position, you know, ready to go in every opportunity. And same thing with Winston, like, you know, he's shoot, got the playbook locked down and it's all about, you know, just going out there and making your play, you know, you're not going to get, you never know, we got so many weapons, you're not going to get that many opportunities, but they've done a really good job of making the most out of all the opportunities they've gotten, and especially Fat, you know what I mean? He's, he's come up and started making great plays and started, um, you know, he's starting to really show himself out there. So uh, I'm really happy for him. Oh, fat. I don't know. That's a nickname, but uh, F-A-T, fat. I don't know. <laughs>
Destin. Yeah. The person is a guy like Destin. You know, I mean, he hasn't played a football game in an mm-hmm. organized game since what I think like 2020. Yeah, no, I, shoot, I, I was really impressed. You know, he came out here just seeing him over the summer, seeing the work he put in over the summer, seeing where he is now. You know what I mean? Like that dude's been working his butt off. So. Um, Seeing him out here making plays like that, running around, uh, fighting through adversity. First couple of days, you know, he, you know, body going through it, not used to it, but seeing him fight through that, you know, that's that's something that I love. Cause shoot, I mean, we've all had to do that at a point in time. So um, yeah, no, he's gonna be great. Uh, shoot, my message to him. I mean, it was just like, you come here, I'm gonna tell you, it's gonna be work 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 and that's that's the thing that coach Novell loves to use I say you're gonna work your butt off but he's gonna bring the best out of you you know regardless and shoot I told him I said you got me out there with you like I know how it went last year coming in you know as a transfer so I'm gonna tell you how it is and you know it's gonna be hard it's gonna be hard but shoot you got dudes around you that are used to it now uh dudes that are gonna try to bring you along with them and I said you come in here you just work do your job and everything else will take care of itself uh shoot, I mean we both go up there and get that ball. Um, you know, like he said, I seen him do an interview, you know, it's not 50 50, 80 20, you know, 90 10. Um so I mean shoot, I mean that's the one thing you know we both talk about all the time, you know, just trying to get those contested catches, you know, those, those are ours. You know what I mean? Um you know, another thing he, he does great, you know, he's just, you know, he puts that speed, you know, on every play. It's like, like, do like him, you know, and you rarely see him get tired. You know what I mean? So um, that's something that I've been, you know, I've been trying to, you know, do for me. I'm like, okay, if he could go five, six plays in a row, I can go five, six plays in a row. So, uh, yeah, I mean, that's what I've been trying to do. There's so much hype around your guys' team this year. Can you just talk about the energy with the wide receivers right now? Uh, sure. I mean, we got a very close room. Uh, all the dudes, you know, we go out to eat together all the time. We hang out together all the time outside of the facility. Um, it makes it makes being, you know, being a leader, it makes it a lot easier. You know, you've got, you got guys that trust you, got guys that, you know, actually want to be around. So, um, shoot, I mean, the receiver group, you know, we became really close. And uh, it, it helps, you know, we, we can learn from each other on the field and practice. No one's really, you know, afraid to be like, you know, this is what you need to do and this is what you need to do, and no one's getting defensive. You know, everyone's taking in the learning, everyone's taking all the coaching from, no matter who it is, from freshman, senior, you know what I mean? Everybody has everybody has their own coaching points, and uh, everyone trusts each other to listen, so. We talked to Jaheim the other day, and his message kind of about the offense was, I mean, you can't double-team everybody. Mm-hmm. Because bringing back as many pieces you have, the pieces you've added, how excited are you to see kind of what this offense even can be? I'm just, I, I'm so excited to go out there and just see everybody, you know, just put put their best version of themselves out there. You know what I mean? Uh, we got so many weapons. Like, it's just, I ain't never been on a team that's loaded. So uh, I'm excited to just see, you know, what everyone can do. Um, you know, dudes are going to have to try to match up everywhere on the field. And, you know, you can never, like you said, you, can, you can't double one person. If you double one person, you got shoot Keon, Jaheim. You got to worry about Trey. You got to worry about Trav. Uh, you know, there's a lot of dudes out here that's going to be making plays. What's unlocked? Say that again. What's unlocked? You, 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 you were six foot seven three years ago. You, you ran this fast three years ago. Mm. Guys get better. I get it. But like, has anything happened to you? Is it, is it a mental thing? Is it a physical thing? What's well, like right that's allowed you to kind of fulfill your potential? Um, I've been trying to take more of the you know the leader role. Uh, I'm trying to be just you know the guy that's going to take take the younger guys and you know try to coach dudes on the field you know what I mean if I'm pushing dudes to do something you know I, I gotta hold myself to that standard as well um, if I'm telling dudes you gotta make this catch you gotta be can't drop the easy ones you know I gotta do the same I gotta do the same and um, you know just gathering everybody you know just trying to be that leader um, trying to be a leader and lead the guys I mean, that, that, that's about it thank you man appreciate y'all